Welcome to Trip Live Radio. I'm Ken Laird. In studio guest today, Derek Stingley, the head coach of the Pittsburgh Power. We are about a month away from opening kickoff of Arena Football League 2014. And uh, coach the Cleveland Gladiators, your big division rival, March the 15th, Saturday at Consol Energy Center. It's uh, almost upon us. Yep, the, the most important game of our season, Cleveland. So that, that's great. We're excited. We're ready to go. It's been a good off season for us. Training camp starts this week, correct? Yeah, the 20th. We start up. We get the players in, we get them with some physicals and do a little conditioning test, see where the guys are at the moment, and then we get on from there. Do you have a, a handle on your guys and how conditioned they are coming in, or does that, is that always a bit of a surprise? First? Well, for, for some guys, it's a surprise. For a few, you, you know that you know they, they take the offseason pretty seriously. Um, we have some new guys that I really don't know a whole lot about, but you know we did you know, good work with recruiting these guys and, you know, from what we saw on film and talking with agents and doing some background work, you know, that there's some good players. So we just want to see what they're, what, what type of shape they're in when they get, get in town. Well, Derek, your third year at the helm uh, as the years have gone on here at Pittsburgh. This is partially your third year, yeah. right? At least, third year at least here. Part, <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> part of 2012 here, uh, moving up from D.C. What have you seen with the program as it's kind of gone on year by year? Well, I mean, I mean, it's, it's been through a lot, you know, just from my first year here with, with the whole, you know, union thing you know, with the players, replacement players, and and a lot of changes within the coaching and, and some, you know, administration changes as well. But I think now, I, I think this is the year. I, I think that we may have, you know, learned from some, some of the things that have happened in the past. Uh, we figured out some of the things that we need to do in all areas of our organization, and I think this is the perfect year for us. And one thing you guys made sure you acquired here in the offseason was a big-time quarterback. <laughs> Tell us about Tommy Grady, who was uh, – we had him in studio here. He could barely fit his head through the through the doorway. <laughs> he's, he's got some size. We've seen that. Yeah, that that's the one thing about him. You know, he's he's a big quarterback, and he's perfect for this league. Um, you know, it's, it's awesome to have – a quarterback that's you know been one of the best in the league you know whether it was this league or the AF2 you know being in arena football the good thing about it is that he understands this game you know he's he's made nothing but big plays he's been a big play quarterback you know wherever he's been um, he's going to come in and help us out tremendously I love his leadership I love the fact that you know he's he wants to be you know heavily involved in the offense and just talking with him it's just those little things that you know we didn't have as an organization with the quarterback you know last year you know we had Jordan Jefferson and Shane and the year before we kind of went through a bunch of quarterbacks since I've been here and we never had one like a Tommy Grady a guy that's almost just perfect for this league and you know I'm pretty sure he's gonna do big things for us this year when you saw him come in with uh, was Utah last year right and he put mm -hmm. up some numbers first game <laughs> did you <laughs> did you <laughs> pull him aside afterward and say hey Tommy let's talk in the offseason you know I, I've, I've competed against Tommy um, a lot throughout my career I knew that he was that type of player um, I didn't know at that moment that you know he would be here with us because you know naturally he was on a three-year contract so mm. you know I, I've always been a fan and I'm glad now that I can be up close and personal with him. Well, you also got him a big target here uh, in the last couple of weeks, trading for Orlando receiver Prashay Rodriguez, who had 41 touchdowns last year. Is that right? Prashay is huge, yes. I mean, he's one of those guys where, you know, this game is perfect for him as well. You know, he's he's not only a big guy that can go up and get it, you know, he can run good routes like a little receiver. Um, he's a great red zone guy. Um, he's a tough tackle, you know, so those type things, you know, added to our offense is just even better, you know, with him, Lesway, uh, we have Sean who played with um, Grady as well. So it's going to be a tough camp, but at the same time, I'm excited because, you know, the receiving core that we have this year, in my opinion, is so much better than what we ever had here before. Well, not only that, uh, and the excitement, you can just tell from listening to you talk about the offense, you'll be a high-flying team this year with some great size. Also, some national television coverage, uh, which the league has never seen uh, at this point, ESPN and CBS Sports. And yeah. you guys have, what, four national TV games? Yeah, it's good to get us out there nationally. You know, to even for the league, it's huge. You know, just so that we can reach other audiences that we haven't had the opportunity to reach before and to put our brand out there. You know, th this is a, a great league. It's a, it's a good avenue for guys who want to move on and go to the next level. You know, it's, a, it's another place for guys who probably can't get to the next level to – 
they may be that diamond in the rough to where they can get some professional football work. So, you know, the excitement is there. I'm pretty sure we'll reach some some other fans that, that will grow to love this game just as well as the ones that's been involved for some time now. Power season tickets starting 2 for $99 and single game tickets as low as 15 bucks. Go to PittsburghPowerFootball.com for more information. Derek Stingley, the head coach of the Power. I'm Ken Laird at TripLive.com.